good day and welcome to this tutorial class all right my name is remains olua tumbi blessing or lalekon the founder of michael tech all right so to solve the problem on the screen the very first thing i'm going to do is to provide a thin horizontal line in this manner okay a thin horizontal line like that so after that i'm going to provide a vertical line okay like this right here all right so uh having my first uh circle right there okay the first external circle is diameter 20 that would be radius of what radius of 10 okay radius 10 this radius 10 with radius 10 sitting at this midpoint i watch i draw this okay you can actually increase the scale of this drawing if it is actually too small for you all right so the internal circle that's diameter 60 that would be radius 30 so quite small like kilo d so it's pretty small okay so yeah you can actually increase the scale like i said earlier on so as to make it convenient for you okay that has been set to like that so from this midpoint towards my left hand side i'm having a mark of 30 a mark of 30 which is this so from here mark of 30 which is this i mark that right there so i'm going to uh project that vertically slightly okay I told you with thin line okay that's it so i'm having an arc of radius seven right there with my compass i pick radius seven which is this with radius seven from this center i would i draw this okay that's it i've drawn that like that okay so now let me move towards this area before i actually finish this area up so towards my uh, right hand side from this midpoint here i'm having a mark of 72 which is this mark of 72 I mark that out first of all after that i'm having a mark of four a mark of four after 72 mark of four which is this mark of four. after mark of four i'm having a mark of 35 which is this so each of these marks i'm going to project them vertically but mostly towards the bottom okay so like this one like this two and like this okay three so from the midpoint of uh this area here this year i'm going to measure mark of 10 upwards mark of 10 and that is this right here so i'm going to project that slightly horizontal okay which is this okay settled now i'm having arc of radius theory right there arc of radius theory with my compass and radius three quite small very very small so from this mark here i produce a circle with radius three okay yeah a slight circle with radius three right there okay after doing that now first of all i'm having an arc of radius 55 coming this way this arc of radius 55 on my arc of radius 10 here is actually an external arc so 55 sorry on my arc of radius 3 here is a what is an external arc so radius 55 plus 3 that is radius what 58 so with my compass intact picking radius 58 which is this with radius 58 which is this so from this midpoint i would i strike my arc as seen so this way it actually touches so then i'm going to pick what radius what radius 55 so with radius 55 now radius 55 on this area where my act touches this vertical line i what i draw so i'm going to draw it faintly first can you see that on the screen yeah faintly first let me zoom it out for you so that you can see very well okay so that is it right there okay so likewise let me do the other part of this one also i'm having arc of radius 65 right there radius 65 on this arc of radius 3 it is actually an internal arc it is an internal arc okay so that's going to be 65 minus 3 65 minus 3 is what is 62 so with my compass i pick radius 62 which is this with radius 62 which is this from this midpoint i strike my arc this way it touches this vertical line here so then i pick radius what radius 65 which is this with radius 65 which is that i stand right here then i would i draw my arc faintly 
I'm also going to draw it what faintly. Okay. Now all remains for me is to get the concluding part here. Okay. So first of all, towards the bottom here, I'm having arc of radius what radius 80. Okay, this arc of radius 80 together with my arc of radius 55 here, they are what external external. So that's going to be 80 plus 55. That is going to be 135 radius 135. So with my compass right here and measuring radius 135 which is this radius 135 which is this okay so i stand right here okay do you see i what uh let me pull it back okay so right there i what i draw my arc like this big this is my arc big okay so now this arc of radius 680 we are talking about it is actually internal to this arc here. it is internal to this arc here. so that's going to be 80 minus 10 80 minus 10 is what is 70 so with my compass i measure radius what radius 70 with radius 70 sitting at this midpoint i what i draw so that is what the intersection right here so this is where the what they intersect so with my compass i measure radius what radius 80 i measure radius 80 which is this with radius 80 sitting at this junction then i what i draw do you see that I what I draw. I make it bold. Okay. After making this bold, I can now come back here and what I make this first one also. Make it bold. Okay, like this. Make it bold like that. Okay. As you can see on the screen right there. So let me get the concluding part of this one here. So I'm making I'm having an arc of radius 65 right here. So arc of radius 65 on this. Okay, it is actually external. Yeah, so that's going to be 65 plus 65, which is what 130. 130 with my compass, I measure 130. Okay, that's 130 right there. So with 130 on my compass, standing at this, do you see that junction? Okay, do you see that junction right there? Let me zoom it out so that you can see. So do you see with radius 130 from that junction? Okay, I'm going to what I'm going to draw my second arc here. Okay, I'm going to draw my arc. So that is my arc right there. That is my arc right there. Okay. Now, on this area, it is also what external. So 65 plus 10. That is what? That is 75. That is 75. With my compass, I measure radius 75. With radius 75 from this midpoint, I what? I draw. So this is where they actually what? intersect so from that intersection i pick my compass and i measure radius what radius uh 65 so with my radius 65 from this intersection i what i draw this you see i make it bold once and for all i make it bold once and for all making it bold once and for all then i can now what come back here and what redraw this like this so redrawing that like that okay so that's it right there so then after doing that so from this level i'm going to align it to that level there then what draw this Do you see that then i'm going to what actually draw this from here to here like this straight forward okay so that is the production of the half spanner sorry half plier on the screen using the principle of curved tangency so kindly ensure you subscribe to our youtube channel and also refer it to your friends who might be in need of it so to put my dimension this right here like this okay then this way i'm having a uh, radius 65 okay this right here like this then this way i'm having radius 55 okay so this right here like this and this way i'm having uh radius 65 then this right here like this okay mm, maybe this order i'm having radius 80 okay so yeah this like this i'm having radius 30 okay 
soon. This, like this, another radius ten. Okay. So this, like this, another radius seven. Okay. Yeah. Then I'm going to project this downward. Then I'm going to draw this like this. Okay. So from here to here, that is what 30. From here to here, that is what 72. From here. To here, that is what 35. Here to here is what is 4. Okay, then this height from here to here, that is what 10. Okay, then uh, this, like this, that is radius 3 okay so that is the production of that object on the screen my name remains Oluwa Tumbi Blessing Olalekon the founder of Michael Tech thank you